Hello brothers and sisters in Christ. I'm here to share with you another video. Actually two. Um, let's see. I want to pull up. Well shoot. I shut it down on an accident or was it here? Yeah. La Palma of Canary Islands went off. This is a, was a live stream and way as you go down it's 58 minutes and by the end of it you'll see it's really on fire. Alright so those of you say it's not going to happen. It already has. Now what's going to happen is it going to now there's a live one going on right now with Reuters. Alright so it's probably going to continue to be live and they'll cut it off every so often. This is 58 minutes worth of it. And this is by Reuters called Live. Volcano erupts on the Palm in the Canary Islands. I'll leave a link in the description box. This other one I wanted to mention happens to be about Yellowstone. Gee, that's right here in the United States of America. And as this guy says, it is God's gun judgment on America. When this thing blows, it's going to affect way more than Yellowstone Park. And you can bet your bottom dollar on that. All right, this is Louise from The Real GS News. Huge Yellowstone volcano struck by 100 earthquakes in the last 24 hours. He says that in Spanish. I don't know how to pronounce it. Cumbre. Vaya. Update. That's that's uh, Canary Islands, I believe. He gives a little update on that. I'll let you hear him for a few minutes. If you, don't want to contribute to the channel, if you can you hear him. He, he, he's got this huge mic. Also, guys, he's got this mic. You know, I had this little tiny round thing. Without it, you can't hear me. So I have this tiny little mic so you can hear me. And he's got this huge one. And I don't know if he's got some kind of setting set on it. But I'm having a hard time hearing him. I hope y'all can hear him. One dollar a month Patreon will get you access to our live stream every Saturday. <laughs> we talk about things that we cannot talk about in this plat, you know, uh, form. Also, guys, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box along with this article. Put on Mr. Magoo glasses here and stuff. Let me see what's going on here. I had to go get some Dunkin' Donuts coffee, guys. You know, I wanted to relax and all. Yeah, he said this is Sunday. I wasn't planning so to do videos that. today. <laughs> today, I'm just going to make like maybe three Well, we've three got stuff hours. going on. i got to spend time with the kids and stuff like that. Right. Okay, I'm just going to cut this to the chase because it's 27 minutes. You can listen to it. He talks about how the magma is like a swamp. There's, if I understood him correctly, because some of the words he says, the way he says it, I don't quite catch. But it sounded like he was saying there is a swamp of magma volcanic magma at Yellowstone and he the way he put it the more people sin the bigger it gets and I believe that you you have to understand that things that are happening in the spiritual world are manifesting in the physical in more ways than one God's judgments are coming we will not be able to pray them away. Mr. Trump will not return and make America great again. You have to understand he is just another one of the dirt bags just like Biden. He touts himself as being the father of the vaccine. He's the one that pushed it with the uh, what did he call it? Um, let's get it out in a hurry. I can't remember now. I can't remember now what he called it. Yeah, I'm sure y'all are saying it out loud and I can't hear you. <laughs> oh. Operation Warp Speed. There we go. So, um, what I want to know, though, 
is how many got the placebo versus the real thing and I can't seem to find anything on it other than that one video I had found where some people got some kind of vaccine that was for hepatitis or not hepatitis um it was an inflammation of the brain itis uh, encephalitis something spinal meningitis something like that that's not really a true placebo because you can still have side effects from that but they wanted everybody to get something See, those, I can't get I can't say no more about it on this platform it all just disgusts me to no end how the powers that be are they're just more some days it gets to me that all the spiritual warfare we do I know the Lord hears our prayers I know he does and when it seems that our prayers are not being answered with a yes I'll do that for you and like he's not listening it just seems that way because we got to remember his will must be done the Satan gets to wear us down the Saints those of us living right I'm trying to do my best at this job that he gave me for the end days and from the very beginning I've had computers fried, nasty comments, being called a liar, false prophet, this and that. And some days, you know, it's just makes you feel.